How you doing? So quick video here on the, the most common mistakes I see when people do mini roundabouts. I'm gonna do this really quickly. I'm gonna do three mistakes I see when people go straight through. Then I'm gonna swing around and then I'm gonna show you three most common mistakes I see when people are turning right on mini roundabouts. All right, so just, I'm gonna get straight into it. So I'm gonna move off here from a park position. Boom, boom. So the first one is really easy, all right, but everyone does it. On this mini roundabout here, there's no road to the right. But in the test, you still have to do your mirror, no signal, position, slow, and look to the right. That's easy. People, when they get to this, they say, ah, lovely, there's no road to the right. I'm gonna take a big look to the left, and that's wrong. You just have to get into your head, I have to look to the right at the mini roundabout, even if there's no road. All right, so the next one I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna go straight through this one, and this is what I see people do all the time as well. So we're going straight through second exit. So you're in position, we slow. This time, you know, we look to the right. They get onto the roundabout and indicate right. It's like, no, it's get around the roundabout, left mirror, left signal. All right. We only indicate right when we're turning right. When you hear the direction, you're going toward a fourth exit to the right. Now, this one is my favorite. So what people tend to do is straight through second exit. So we know we're in position. We know we slow at the break. We know we look to the right. They get onto the roundabout and all they can do is they look here and then when they look up, it's like, whoa, they're coming straight into the path. Better way to do this would be, so you're in position, you slow at the break, you look to the right, drive onto the roundabout, steer around the footpath first, and the last thing you do, left mirror, left signal. Steer and forced, it's very important. So now I'm gonna take the second exit to the right. So once you hear right, you know it's mirror, signal, right. So usually what happens here is when people get to the roundabout, they look to the right. Because they know they need to do a load of steering, they go heavy on the gas, and then it's like, and it's way too fast, all right? When you're doing the mini roundabouts, once you get into position, you're off the accelerator. Um, or, and if you're in the manual, you're in force and you do them. The last one we are driving too fast, all right? The next one that I tend to see is, so steering too early, all right? So now we figured out the speed. Now we're gonna turn right at this. So mirror, signal, position, just like a right turn. I'm on the brake, I know I look to the right. So now I know I'm gonna do this in forced or just in the automatic, just really slowly, all right? Why people drive over the, the road marking is because they steer too early. The trick is get your front wheels past the mini roundabout. Once your front wheels get past it, then you kind of lock your wheel to the right. And then you kind of undo it, all right? And the, another common mistake I always see is this, all right? So now we know what turn and right, it's a third exit on this one. Mirror, signal, position, slow. I know I'm to look, I know I'm turning right, so I'm going slowly. I know I get my front wheels past the roundabout. What I see people is, they're looking up that way, trying to steer down this way. I can't even do that myself. That was really awkward. It's like when you're turning right. You have to look where you're going. So I'm gonna do a right turn after this left. I'll show you what I mean. It's the same as turning right with the observation. So because of this, so mirror, I'm gonna turn right here. I'm gonna go straight, but this car is giving me bad position. I'm on the, I'm kind of just keeping the doors with, but I'm straight. I look, no, there's nothing there. So in, instead of me looking this way, going down that way, I have to look this way. And when you look where you're going, it's so much easier. You have to look where you're going. And when we're going straight through the mini roundabout and it's the forced exit, really forced exit, mirror, signal left on approach, slow, we know we look to the right and just go straight through. And just try to keep it in on the left here. People tend to come out to the middle of the road, just in on the left. And that's it, that's the most common mistakes I see when people do mini roundabouts. Just have a look and figure out what you're doing yourself. If it's not working, then it must be something that you're doing. 
Um, also, I've seen a comment on one of the one of my last mini roundabout posts saying that they haven't got enough time. The reason why you haven't got enough time is because you're going too fast. Think about it. If you slow down a little bit, you would have more time to do all your all your manoeuvres. All right. So I hope this video helped. 